Why, hello there. Aw, why the long face? Come on, you can tell me. Is it because it's Valentine's Day? Are you in a relationship? Do you have a plan? <laughs> ah, that's okay. At the end of the day, Valentine's Day is just a day for someone to spend time with the ones you love. Well, how about I help you with that? Why, yes, of course. In fact, I might just have the perfect idea for you. You seem to like video games. Do you like video games? What about your loved one? Do they love video games? Why, that's great. Then all you gotta do is follow my four easy steps process and you'll be guaranteed to have the perfect Valentine's date this year. First things first. Begin by simply asking your loved one for a movie night. If they happen to be free and agree to the plan, you'll be ready for step two. Secondly, in situations like these, you could let your loved one pick something out. But there are also times where they will ask you to pick something out. In this case, the best movie to watch on Valentine's Day is, of course, Sonic the Hedgehog. Why, here you go. This movie came out on February 14th, 2020, which means it turns four years old today. When originally first revealed, this movie was looking to become a horrible film adaptation because of the design of Sonic. But then the filmmakers had a moment of redemption and changed his design. So, with the release of February 14th, not only are you celebrating with your loved one, but you are also celebrating the fourth anniversary of the first Sonic movie. <laughs> Step number three. After finishing the movie, be sure to begin watching the second Sonic movie. Here, take it. You won't regret it. The second movie is much better than the first. In fact, I highly encourage you watch these movies to catch up. Why, yes. Later this year, we will be getting a Knuckles TV show on Paramount+, Plus, and then this Christmas, we will be getting a third Sonic movie. So best to catch up with the story before these next two projects come out. Now off you go and have a wonderful Valentine's date. Uh-oh, what happened? That's a shame. But that's okay, because this brings us to our final step. Always remember that no matter what, the geniuses working over at the TGL are constantly finding new ways to improve human and non-human socialization with their brand new experiments. So long you don't go snooping around like these two. Anyways, Happy Valentine's Day to all from all of us at the TGL. Bye-bye now. <laughs>